Boston Dynamics has brought Atlas back to life, but this isn't the same robot you remember. What was once a viral sensation known for backflips and flashy parkour is now a full-fledged industrial-grade machine. This latest version of Atlas isn't just performing stunts for the camera, it's learning how to work, solve real-world problems, and adapt to unpredictable environments. Fully electric, packed with AI, and built for agility, Atlas is stepping into a new era. The transformation began in 2024 when Boston Dynamics officially retired its iconic hydraulic Atlas. That version, famous for wowing millions online, was never designed for commercial use. It was a testbed for movement, agility, and control. But now, Boston Dynamics is refocusing Atlas on practical deployment. The updated robot looks different, moves smarter, and is trained to handle jobs humans do every day. At NVIDIA's GTC 2025 conference, the new electric Atlas was introduced to the world with a dramatic demonstration. In a one-minute demo clip, Atlas runs, crawls, balances, and adapts its posture on the fly. It's not just about acrobatics, though it does perform somersaults, handstands, and cartwheels with impressive control. What's more important is how those movements translate into practical ability. Boston Dynamics is now focused on turning that showmanship into workhorse utility. Underneath the sleek new design is powerful hardware, running on NVIDIA's Jetson Thor AI computing platform. This cutting-edge processor is built specifically for robotics and humanoid motion, enabling Atlas to process visual input, understand its surroundings, and react instantly to unexpected changes. It's like giving the robot a brain that can learn from its environment instead of following rigid instructions. What makes Atlas unique is how it learns to move. The company teamed up with the Robotics and AI Institute to develop reinforcement learning models that teach Atlas through experience. In a simulated space, the robot is given tasks to perform, and over time, it gets better by trial and error. It's similar to how a person learns to ride a bike, fail, adjust, try again. But for Atlas, these simulations happen at lightning speed using NVIDIA's Isaac platform and Newton physics engine developed in collaboration with Google DeepMind and Disney Research. And Boston Dynamics isn't just training Atlas to move better, they're giving it jobs. One of its biggest training grounds right now is in Hyundai's auto factories. The robot is being prepared for part sequencing, an important but difficult task in car assembly lines. Parts arrive at the factory in unsorted batches, and before they can be used, they must be organized in a specific order. That process is currently done by humans because it's too unpredictable for typical robots. But Atlas is learning how to recognize, pick, and arrange parts of different shapes, sizes, and weights without human help. This is where Atlas's full range of motion becomes critical. It needs to reach awkwardly placed parts, adjust its grip depending on the object, and correct mistakes if something slips or is out of place. Unlike traditional robotic arms, Atlas has to think in three dimensions, solve problems on the fly, and make corrections, all while maintaining balance and adapting its stance. If the robot can handle this task consistently, it opens the door to a much broader set of roles in factories and warehouses. Boston Dynamics has plans to scale Atlas into mass production, alongside its already commercialized quadruped robot, Spot. This cycle of simulation and real-world execution is key to how modern humanoid robots learn. But the competition is fierce. While Boston Dynamics was once a solitary leader in humanoid robotics, it now shares the stage with a flood of startups and tech giants. Companies from both the US and China are racing to build the most capable, affordable, and versatile humanoids. And among them, Unitree Robotics is making serious noise. Unitree, based in China, recently introduced the G1, its latest small humanoid. Despite its smaller stature, just over four feet tall, the G1 stunned the robotics world by performing a standing long jump of 1.4 meters. That jump is a record-breaking move for a robot of its size and showcases the raw power built into its frame. The secret? Advanced joints with torque up to 120 newton meters and freedom of movement between 23 and 43 degrees depending on the joint. That kind of flexibility allows the G1 to move dynamically and adjust its posture like a gymnast. Unitree's robots are trained with NVIDIA's reinforcement learning tools too, showing how critical AI simulations have become across the robotics industry. But where the G1 shines is not just in strength, it's in coordination and intelligence. 
The robot can identify objects, listen to voice commands, and navigate cluttered environments using 3D LiDAR, stereo vision, and directional microphones. Its skill set is growing fast. In recent months, Unitree has demonstrated the G1 performing tasks that would typically require human finesse, hammering nails, stirring food, and even soldering components onto circuit boards. And it's not doing these tasks step-by-step -step through code. It's learning the motion patterns and executing them fluidly, just like a person might. The G1 first caught international attention during the 2025 Spring Festival Gala in China. A fleet of these robots performed a synchronized dance routine alongside human performers, dressed in traditional costumes and keeping perfect rhythm. The performance, powered by Alibaba AI, was broadcast to over a billion viewers. It wasn't just a show, it was a message. China is becoming a serious force in robotics, and Unitree is leading the charge. Unitree's innovation didn't stop there. Their full-sized humanoid, the H1, became the first electric humanoid robot to perform a standing backflip in early 2024. It's a milestone that Boston Dynamics' old hydraulic atlas achieved years before, but the new electric H1 caught up fast. Then came the December 2024 holiday showcase, where Unitree brought its robots back with even more precise movement and balance. Other Chinese robotics startups are entering the race too. Engine AI, another player from Shenzhen, recently posted a video of its small humanoid robot pulling off a front flip, clearly inspired by Hong Kong action films. The video was as entertaining as it was impressive, showing just how fast these companies are blending engineering with culture and creativity. So now, the global race for humanoid supremacy is wide open. On one side, Boston Dynamics has deep technical experience, a proven engineering record, and the backing of Hyundai. On the other, Unitree is fast, aggressive, and not afraid to push the boundaries with public demonstrations and bold claims. Each company is carving out its own vision for what humanoid robots should be. For Boston Dynamics, it's about stability, industrial reliability, and learning through structured simulation. For Unitree, it's about athleticism, real-world versatility, and creating machines that can adapt to daily life at a much lower cost. And this brings up the bigger question. What role will humanoid robots actually play in our lives in the next five to 10 years? Will they work in factories, replacing repetitive labor? Will they become household assistants, helping with cooking, cleaning, or elderly care? Or will they be reserved for specialized environments like disaster zones, hospitals, and construction sites? The reality is, we're only beginning to scratch the surface. What's clear is that robots are getting faster, stronger, and smarter at a pace we've never seen before. They're not just mimicking human movement anymore, they're beginning to understand it. That shift from programmed motion to adaptive intelligence is what will define the next decade of robotics. Boston Dynamics Atlas and Unitree's G1 are at the forefront of that transformation. Each new demo, each successful task, and each jump or flip is more than a spectacle. It's a signal that robots are closing the gap. And soon, the world will need to figure out how to integrate these machines into society safely, ethically, and effectively. If you want to follow the future of robotics, from AI-powered factory workers to agile machines that can cook dinner or perform stunts, you're in the right place. Don't miss out on what comes next. Make sure to subscribe for more deep dives into the technologies that are reshaping the world, one robot at a time.